Hi all, it's Kara from the Transformation Mom for A, B, C, D, E. And when I last left you, we had did layouts number 14 and 15. And we had did these two little pockets with the little tags with the writing on the back. You can see that when I left you, I said I was just going to glue these on and then put those in there. Well, I didn't like how these were just sliding around in there. So I decided to add some cute little ribbon. So now that will stick out the side like the rest of it. So, you know, sometimes after I finish with you guys, I decide to do something different. So that was what I did today. So today we are going to do the 16. And so I'm just gonna set my journal aside. Again, it's on another eight and a half by five and a half sheet of paper. So that's just to keep that in mind. So I did get a piece of the background paper that is five and a quarter by eight and a quarter. And this day was kind of, this is one of those days where you just have to chalk it up. So, um, in the morning we had decorated their little Christmas tree that's down in their toy room and then in the afternoon we got to all have toast for dinner because every single one of us was feeling under the weather so yeah it was bad so that's that's kind of this day is kind of a wash but this was the back of one of the gift cards like a little piece of it and so I just figured I could use that to put the numbers on I thought that would just be a cute way to use up the gift card Again, I am just trying to use every last little scrap that I have. Not that I'm running out of paper, just that I don't like to waste things. And so that's kind of where I'm at there. You know, that usually if it's really small, I'll throw it away, but this is a good purpose for that. So there is that, and we will glue our numbers onto there. And I'm still using this that I really don't like but again I am not a wasteful person so I will use it until it is gone some people my husband laughs about it because he's like if you don't like it just you know ask if somebody does like it and give it away or just throw it away and <laughs> I can't I can't do that so so there's our little numbers for this one that was a little crooked so I'm just going to set that aside to dry. Now, what I thought about doing on this one was making this into like a little pennant. And so what I could do with this is I just, this is a piece of the book jacket from the book that I used to actually make my cover with. So this is a piece of the book jacket and I just decoupaged some of the tissue paper onto it. So what I'm going to do is we can turn around and put this right in the middle so this is actually two inches so I can put a line right here and put a line here in the middle just to get it started and if I turn around and I measure a inch up I'm just gonna put another little line an inch up okay and I can go right where those two points meet so it's kind of hard to see because it's blue on black. You can get the corner in that and just match it up. And then we're going to do the same thing for the other side. We're going to match it up there. And then I'm just going to get my scissors as soon as I can get my pen put away. And I am just going to cut up to that mark. And then cut up to that mark. And that will give me a little pen pennant like shape. And then I'm just going to go on my cutter here. And I don't like how there's some of the white sticking out the sides there. So I am just going to give it a really quick little trim. So you can see I just cut off that little itty bit on the one side. I'm just going to cut a little itty bit off the other side. And there we go. Now that looks a little better. So there is kind of that. So I thought I'm just going to put that right down that side of the piece of paper. Thinking that that's kind of neat looking. So 
so that's just gonna go right down the side there okay so now what I thought was I found another quote that I had really liked out of that quote and it's each of us is an innkeeper who decides if there's room for Jesus and so I kind of really like that quote so I got a piece of the red folder and I am going to put that quote on the red folder and then what I thought I would do is use that to make a pocket on the bottom of here and especially because everybody ended up sick this day I thought we could put the toast picture in there you know the I don't want to say unpleasantness of the day but keep the let's make sure that's the top the look at how I don't want to say how great our day was but despite being sick we all still had fun and got to do something nice that you know the toast the toast happened but it wasn't it didn't ruin our day we let, we didn't let it ruin our day how about that <laughs> so there is that part and we're just gonna put that down like that get out my picker I'll pull this up and I, I want to make it so let me let me think about this here so what I thought was that we'll put those two other pictures because they're vertical somewhere up there I can kind of put this over here closer and then where's my number Put that kind of in that range, I think. Or do I? Let's see here. See so, now, of course, I, I do this to myself all the time. If I put those two up there, how far down can I go before the number will stick out? Yeah, see, I would have to go pretty far down. I want to go that way so if I you know if I go down to about there me and then this would have to go there and it, okay or do I put this up there I'm just gonna put it upside down so that I don't stick it to anything because <laughs> that's You know that's how my life goes I'll stick it to something and go like that and put that down there I think I got it okay thank you for bearing with me while we while I decide what I'm doing here so we're gonna put this right here up in the middle because that will look really cool and then we can stick my photos on here And see I kind of a lot of times when I film I do have some kind of idea of what I want to do but I don't <laughs> quite have all the details yet and that's what happened there so let's And that should fit really nicely right in there. I'm hoping that everybody gets over the sickness and that we are all ready because it is coming up to be the week of Christmas and with everything else going on. So then that will go in there. I'm just really hoping that I can keep the sickness at bay. 
I'm hoping that all seven of us had it and now we're done and we'll be ready for the rest of the holiday season. Come on. And so that's just gonna go right into there. And that will be my layout for today. I am going to add a piece of the gold or the red glitter ribbon so that you can pull it in and out. And I'll write on the back and put it in the journal. So that is our day 16. I hope you guys enjoyed this journal with me. Have a great day.